A would-be robber possibly hit by gunfire in Chesapeake is breaking news. Police are still looking for him tonight. He was able to get away after the incident at the Exxon on Military Highway earlier tonight. And Senator Size Jason Marks is there live. Jason, what's the latest? Well, Nicole, that search for that suspect has been going on for a couple hours. That started as soon as that call came in, right around 7.15 here at the Exxon on South Military Highway. Now, it was around 7.15 uh, in Chesapeake that uh, we're told that a man walked in with a gun, presented that gun to the clerk, and then somewhere along the way there was some sort of altercation inside the store, and then gunfire went off. Police aren't yet saying who pulled the trigger. The suspect then ran off to a nearby mobile home park. Now, with the help of Virginia Beach police, officers searched for the suspect using dogs and a helicopter, but weren't able to find him. At first, it was thought the suspect was shot, but now officers aren't sure that's the case. I can tell you Portsmouth police say that a man who had a gunshot wound walked into Maryview Medical Center around 740. So just about a half an hour later, police are checking there to see if there's any connection. Police do tell us that the suspect had a dark gray hoodie, black workout pants with a white stripe down the side, and he's wearing a baseball cap with the word Kroger written across of it. Uh, of course, we're going to continue to follow this story throughout the overnight hours. One other thing about this Exxon, uh, there was an armed robbery here uh, just about a month ago. That's the latest here in Chesapeake. Jason Marks, 10 on your side.